Hello, uh, Alan Wright and the, uh, the wiring up of uh, Showa Power Boosters. Um, there's a magnetic flow switch in here and powers up when you plug in the transformer. Now, you know you've wired it up correctly because if the light doesn't come on, you've wired it up incorrectly. The only other two wires go together, and that's the SP2, fully automatic. This is it. Now, for some people, um, they'll need one on the hot and one on the cold. Um, and in that case, the single transformer will power up two pumps, and this is the three-way connector. So, okay, instead of plugging into the flow switch, we're now going to plug into the three-way adapter. And you'll see we've got two males and one into one pump, one into the other pump. Now, that is running both pumps totally independent. However, um, it's much better if you can have a, a situation where both pumps come on at the same time even if there's not enough flow to run one or other of the flow switches and this is where the four-way comes in and the four-way simply male female Female. So everything is connected to everything. And this time, when one pump comes on, both pumps run. Now, that's how to wire up the SP22S. Two fully automatic pumps, one on the hot, one on the cold. Now, there's a, a little trick which can clear air if there's any air in the system before you wire it up properly and what I would recommend is when you fit these in order to clear any potential air and nine times out of ten you won't need it but if you do have air let's take the four way out for a moment and unplug the flow switch and unplug the other flow switch. Now this three-way which powers up the two flow switches can power up one, two pumps. Now this has made them run manually without uh, the flow switches so if there's not enough air to run a flow switch this should actually clear that air so it's a good idea to actually run the two pumps in manual mode when you first fit them. And then, after you've cleared the air, plug back the flow switches, you see the light comes on. The light comes on, that means you've wired it up correctly. And now, we've got these two spare wires. If it was just a single pump, you'd put that and that together. There's the four way way connects to there so one pump done the other pump done and as you see all the wires are connected to everything now there are diagrams in the uh, manual that you get um, you should be able to follow it it's, it's easy when you know how um, there's no way you can wire up any of these pumps in such a way that it'll blow anything. You're not going to damage it. But light on means the flow switch is activated. And that's what you should see when you walk away and you get fully automatic on the hot and the cold. Thank you very much.